Let's fill in then. Just top, slide round, Dylan. Distances. Well, we, we've got we've got to this stage uh, a day before the first game of the season, whereby we've had to do a a six week. Uh, in six weeks, we've had to do what other clubs have had years, or in some cases decades, to, to get to the point of having an, a, a playing squad, coaching staff, youth team, youth team backroom staff, physio provisions, sports science, uh, strength and conditioning, gym programs, medical screening. We've had to do all of that in six weeks. Um, we find ourselves, say, a day before the game, whereby we have a squad which. I would be quite confident in saying is beyond what we, I think everybody in Nelson originally thought we'd be able to put together. We've attracted some real quality players, players with good pedigree and good backgrounds to them. The fact that we start the, the, the season tomorrow, um, doesn't, it's not daunting. The fact that I don't believe was, was the finished article or anywhere near it doesn't frighten me. Uh, I think it's very exciting to, to think that we're actually now going to be a National League team. I think we must must not must not get beat. You know, um, it'd be nice to put in a good performance and not get beat. That's if you go down there and play really well and get beat, that's football. That happens. But I think we've got to, got to start well and show teams in the league that we'd, we'd be a decent side. And you know, we're not just going to come over and roll over and you can tickle our tummies. You know, we're we're in the league um, on merit. Um, you know, the, the guys here put a great bid in to get Tasman back into into National League football, and, and I think they put a good squad together. So it's now down to us as players to go out and prove that we're that we're capable of playing at this level, and and we'll be able to for the rest of the season. We are about ooh, eight minutes from kickoff. All I've done those final messages is go through the way that we're going to play for the first ten minutes. Um, intention being is that anything we've covered the game plan during the course of the week. It's just a reminder now of how we're going to try and start the game, and hopefully uh, it will be effective. And if we manage it, we'll, we should find ourselves with momentum in our favour and on top of the game. Around the back of the 11. Second ball, then. Go on, Ermel. Through to Ermel. Good lad. Completely against the run of play. Last three of this half. Other than that, fellas, I could not be any happier with that first 45. Quite a couple of things was halfway. Um, I, I, I couldn't fault the effort, the commitment of the, of the players. The, the boys are absolutely fantastic. I think they should feel very, very hard done by that we find ourselves 1-0 down. But uh, their, their reaction and attitude to bounce back as almost straight away 
was more than we could have asked for. Um, so looking forward to the second half, um, we know they're going to come at us. Uh, we know that they viewed us uh, as uh, little Tasman. Um, some of the comments previous to, uh, prior to the game I think have, have riled some of our boys up and uh, I think we'll probably see a more true reflection of Canterbury in the second half. So if we can match their effort and their commitment and uh, get the ball moving at tempo, then hopefully we'll see, see this through. First couple, hit him. If you can stretch their back for keeper, 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 keeper. keeper, you're all right, but there is no lost causes. Ball work for them. Jordan! Jordan! Five seconds. That's it. You showed fantastic character, great commitment, fantastic determination. You played some good football. That's the start now. We said before a couple of weeks ago that we aren't a National League team. We're not a National League team until the end of this first game. I'll tell you what, you're a National League team now. Everyone's going to look at that result and say you've just drawn in your first game with a team that finished fourth. <laughs> I'm excited now to see what's going to happen because we're going to keep getting better and better and better. There is no excuse with this result today why we can't go to Auckland City and get a result. We no reason why we can't go to play the Phoenix in two weeks' time and pick up three points. Fellas, be very proud of your performance today. Very pleased with yourself. I'm thrilled. We're only going to get better from here. Well done.